as a partner, how do I access this new technology? And also if we could get in the weeds a little bit on how do we actually order it? Alan, we'll start with you. Sure. Um, so we have, uh, if you go to our uh, webpage, we have the product information posted there. We also have uh, di different uh, uh, application nodes, uh, white paper around 60 gigahertz. Uh, so I highly recommend go to Cambium webpage. If you are a, a, a existing Cambium customer or a partner of Cambium, you can also go to the Cambium online training webpage. It's, uh, it's learning.cambiumnetworks.com. And we have training courses, you know, free training courses on Seeing Wave. All you need to do is you, need, you do need an account to log in, then uh, the course is free. Uh, it will tell you the product. To buy the product, uh, we, we the product already released uh, uh, for ready for pre-orders. And we know our distributors already have the orders as well. Uh, and the product will be shipping by end of October. Uh, so, you know, but all the partners, distributors, they're open to take orders. So if you, you want to order the product, you can also go to KMBM webpage to, to see where I want to order. We will provide you the list of uh, channel partners, uh, their contact, their name, and you can reach out. Uh, from there to you know order seeing wave and uh, to play this radios once we are shipping so so cameron and chris there, there's no need for a partner to call a carrier you don't have to call and try to get access to the spectrum uh, none of that complexity is involved here it's literally just go to www.cambiumnetworks.com upper right hand corner join the partner program and, and you have access to the, the learning management system. You have access to the tools you need to quote, deploy, site survey, um, everything you need to be successful. Perfect. Well, uh, Cam, are there any more questions? Nope, we're clear. Oh, there's nope. some, actually, you know what? There's two in the chat here. Just about missed them. Uh, due to local regs, we cannot do outdoor PNP in 60 gigahertz. Is mesh still possible with CN Wave? Can we create mesh cabling V3000 all back to back? Or do, is there a mesh, mesh routing strictly built into the V5000? The, the mesh is, can be used for our product, uh, our product. So it's all the radio are software defined. So it's not saying mesh can only for a product. Uh, all CN Wave models support mesh. Uh, I, I I missed the first question. What's the question? Is uh, uh, I would love to know about the tech that would replace the Force 180 for customer service, but with greater bandwidth capacity, and how far in kilometers we could reach it. Oh, Force 180. Uh, no, there's, so there's two separate questions here. It looks like. <laughs> so Force 180 is a five gigahertz radio, and uh, that one we we normally talk about. You know, uh, I think four, five, six miles. If you, I think for Force 180 also have a connectorized version, if I'm correct. Connectorized version with a bigger dish can reach even longer distance. For the integrity dish version, uh, you know, normally we talk about uh, four, five, six miles range. Okay. And then we have one more question, two more questions. <laughs> There's a lot of interest in this guys. Uh, 900 megahertz was great until it got crowded. 60 gigahertz is great because it's not crowded. Uh, do you think 60 gigahertz is somewhat future-proof as a result of the line of sight and, and, and range? Um, yeah. So for 60 gigahertz, because we're using the uh, AY standard, we can do one network, one channel. Uh, so there is a big improvement or uh, you know, frequency reuse compare with other frequency. Normally, like if you go with 900 megahertz or five gigahertz, you do need several channels to do a network plan. And in our thing is we do one channel, one network. Literally, you don't need to do frequency planning because you choose channel one, you're using channel one everywhere. Um, but, you know, 60 gigahertz only have four channels available or for, you know, we are supporting from channel one, channel four. So literally we have four channels. Uh, if you do have many operators, let's say in the location you have more than four operators going to operate in the same location, uh, I think that will bring the challenge uh, for interference. Uh, hopefully, I think by business, by economic nature, once you have up to four operators in the same location, the, the new one probably will not really enter to this area given, um, you know, 
there was no ready, no free channels. If you add in, not only your own network will not run properly or get the performance you want, you will also cross uh, interference the other channel network. Uh, so, you know, I think uh, we do recommend or we suggest some coordination between operators to maximize uh, frequency um, or spectrum usage on 60 gigahertz. All right, and actually the last question. Um, concerning the MCU size, is there any model that's able to support jumbo frames? Today we support jumbo frame up to 4,000 byte and we will support 9,600 bytes in the future software. Perfect.